CrazyMikeSapps.com with an Android app video review for Bubble Witch Saga. This epic bubble shooter game is fun, but gets really hard and pushes in-app purchases like a drug dealer. Jumping into the gameplay, here's a look at the massive game board for this game. We're heading into level 9, I played it and only got one star, so I'm giving it another try. You can get magic potions through coins you've earned, or you can buy scrolls, which cost money before you start the game. Also in the top right, the blue colored circles there are also in-app purchases. On the left side, the bubbles with the plus sign are also in-app purchases. You're trying to make bubble matches of three or more. Your bubbles come out of the cauldron. You can tap on the cauldron to change the bubble, and you can see your directional shooter. You want to use bank shots when you need to, but do them successfully, not like I just did. Now, when the bubbles fall, the spiders are your friends. They give you increased multiplier points before the bubbles fall into the jars where you get your main points. You're trying to get big drops like that because you only have so many bubbles. Also, you got to clear so many bubbles from the top row. You can see the twinkling star is the top row. I only needed two. I got the rest of the pumpkins. I speeded this up for time so you wouldn't be bored watching slow falling bubbles. Well done. I got two stars. I got 100 crown coins and I got an extra star out of the whole deal, which is good. You can see the breakdown there. More in-app purchases. Also, if you're failing in a level, you're going to get hit up with in-app purchases before the level's over and then after the level to replay it with more bubbles. It's all about the bubbles. This game is fun. It is difficult, though. Playing it for free is definitely a challenge. It does connect with Facebook so you can actually get lives from friends because you only get three lives at a time. Once they run out, you need to wait for them to recharge. It doesn't take too long to recharge. I think it's about three minutes or four minutes for one life to recharge. You can only have three, but I'm sure there's an in-app purchase which allows you to buy more. Now notice this is a daily challenge and you'll actually get some decent amount of coins depending on how many stars you get at the bottom. And that's the way this daily game plays. Now you can play this daily game over and over, but it does cost you a heart life. Notice I'm running out of bubbles and they've got the plus 30 for 99 cents there prominently displayed. King.com does a very good job of using in-app purchases. They, you know, I call it the drug dealer or crack cocaine method. They are the makers of Candy Crush Saga, currently the number one Google Play grossing app as well as a top grossing app in iTunes. That's it for Bubble Witch Saga. You can download it using the link below. Until next time, Crazy Mike from CrazyMikeSapps.com. See and see ya.